Hello y'all, we're back from today's excursions from Bristol and we'll show you what we found on our Funko Pop hunt, mega hunt, because we went to like eight stores or more. <laughs> I lost oh God. my gosh, but here's the first one we got. It is called Duck Funny from an old cartoon I used to watch on Nickelodeon when I was a little girl from the 90s. Um, and on the back, you can see the other characters that you can get. Patty is the girl that he used to have a crush on. And Porkchop was his dog. And, of course, you see Doug. Dave's going to take it out of the box so that we can show you what the actual Funko looks like outside of the box. And we got these, this one from Entertainer for £3.33. and p Bargain. But there's Doug. This cute little hair. He's not got a lot of hair. He doesn't have much hair, no. That's what we call a spiky hair. <laughs> That's okay. very cute. But that was the first one. Hopefully he'll stand. Uh-huh. He's standing up all right. Yeah. All right. Now, the second one we got from the entertainer was da -da -da -da, Captain Marvel. Yeah, you've been wanting this Oh, one. yeah. And on the back of it, it does show, like, all the other characters you can get from the Marvel line. From Captain Marvel. But yeah, very nice pop. And Davey's. Nice box. Yeah, very nice box. But I'll probably keep this one out of the box because I'm an inbox, in out of the box a collector. And Davey's going to open it to show you that one as well. And this one was a bargain price as well at the entertainer for £3.33. <laughs> Can't go wrong. And this one comes with a stand, I do believe. I hope so, because they're little legs. It does come with a stand. Good, 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 good. Honor. Yeah, and it's also a bobblehead. It's a bobblehead, yeah. So it's really good to have a stand for the ones that have the bobbleheads. Otherwise, they just tip over and just fall flat on their face. So, if you could put that on the stand for me. <laughs> Needs a stand because she's already falling over. I know, she's already trying to fall over. Find the foot that's got a hole. Mm hmm. There it is. Usually they're pretty good about standing. There we go. Alright, the next one we found, well, actually, Dave found this one for me from HMV. It is a series we're watching now, season three of. And it's Maeve from Westworld. And these were two for ten pounds, so. Yep. That's a pretty good price. And you can show the other characters. You can see the other ones that are in this series. This is when she's uh, a saloon worker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so this was really was uh, back in the first season. I think it was first season. Yeah, she was like a saloon this is girl. Completely different. Now. Yeah, totally different now if you're up um, watching season three. But this one was really cool, but it doesn't have a stand. Oh no. Mm -hmm. So, mm, but we'll just show it to you. It's not a bubble head, so. No, but still, right. put her down there on your side. No, I gotta stand her on the box to see if she stands up. She's got a, a little tail bit there, the, the back of her dress, so that might, that might help stabilize her. her. We'll soon see. <laughs> no. no, she don't. She don't want it. Yeah, she's standing up. Oh, there we go. And I got that one. Uh, it was two for five. Or so sorry, two for ten pounds at H and B. So to make up the two for ten, I got Gert Yorks from the Runaways. She's um, the fourth one I have in the series. I need two more from the series to have the complete collection. But yeah. But the Runaways is a, uh, you can watch it on Disney Plus. It's really, really a good show. There's two seasons. Hopefully, there'll be a third. Hope yeah. so. Yeah, that'd be good. But this one's really they cool. Left, they left it open. Right? Yeah. And this is considered supposed to be marble. But there you go. So she should have a shaky head. Yeah, this is, she has got a shaky head. <laughs> a little bit of bubble, bubble, bubble. The bobble head. Yeah. Very detailed. I love her hair. I nice. wish my hair was that color. Nice purple hair. Mm hmm. A big glasses. old bobblehead. And she comes with a stand. Thank God. Know. Thank goodness. Uh, stick that in the hole in her foot. Mm -hmm. and she should stand up nicely. Yeah. There's a bit she'll topple over. Just careful with 
this one. I know, that's the thing. But there you go. So, so far, we've got four Funko Pops from our excursion. Now, we went to B&M, and I found one I was amazed I actually found. And, Dave's going to show you. Yeah. You just like this one so much that you had to get it. I know. And this is a... Movie moment from Game of Thrones. And it's... I don't know they can call it a movie moment because it's on the movie. But still, that's what they're <laughs> called. But yeah, it's from the Game of Thrones. Daenerys and Jorah. And this is the very top shelf, kind of behind everything. It was really dusty and stuff, so it might have been there for a while. It's quite a nice... Not sure. Quite a nice box. It's mm. sure everything in it. Yep. But, but let's take it out of the box because that's probably what I'll do. I don't know, though. I might keep it in the box because it might be easier to display. But for you guys, we'll take it out of the box just so you can see it better. It'll take up less space out of the box. Yeah, but the thing is, they're nicely stackable. Yeah. It's a bit... It doesn't want to... Oh, there's a piece of tape. Yeah. So they don't push it in. And this one at B&M, when it rung up, was $14.99. It's about anywhere else I've seen price from 30 to 35 pounds. So I thought that was a pretty good bargain, you know. Especially for this detailed of a pop. A pop moment. Pop moment. There we go. If you're for Game of Thrones fans, you know that this is from the last season. I'm not going to give away any spoilers, but yeah, that's them in flames, and they're fighting things. I'm not going to say what, but a very good pop, I think, especially with the flames and such. But yeah, there we go. those are the pops we found today on our mega Funko Pop hunt. So, we hope you enjoyed this, and let us know which one's been your favorite Funko that we found today. Um, mine personally was, e I think mine was Gert. Because I just think she's really cool. Which one was your favorite? Oh, definitely this one. <laughs> and this is for someone who doesn't really like Funko Pops. But I can see him liking this one because it's kind of manly. Plus it's Daenerys because he <laughs> oh, thinks she's pretty. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Alright, well, well, I hope you liked the video that we made today. Just give us a like and make a comment. Just let us know what else we can do for you guys. And we'll do another one very soon. Bye. Bye.